What do you need? Pleasure doing business with you. say anything yet. I need some time to think. I might be ready to talk about it when classes are done for the day. Somewhere private. Maybe a rooftop? Behind the air vents? Okay. I'll wait until you're ready to talk. Would you like to take a stroll around the school to take your mind off of it? You still haven't joined a club yet. Maybe we can check out the club rooms. Yeah. Yeah. That sounds nice. Sure. Let's do it. I'm sorry, Osana, but I overheard your phone call earlier today. You sounded really upset. Is something wrong? I... well... yeah. I do have a problem, but I'm not really sure if you'd be able to help me. Please, tell me what's wrong. I'll listen. A few days ago, in Shizuta town, this weird guy approached me and started flirting with me. He was really creepy and gross, and I wasn't interested in him at all. It took forever to make him leave me alone. The next day, I started getting text messages from him, even though I never gave him my phone number. The worst part is... He keeps texting me pictures that he's taken of me. It's like he's just following me around and snapping photos all day. You've got a stalker? Oh my god, that's horrible. You need to tell the police before he does something bad. No, I can't do that. He told me that if I go to the police, he'll... He'll... What? What will he do? I... I don't want to tell you, but... But calling the police is not an option! What is it? Is he blackmailing you? Are you hiding some kind of secret? No, it's nothing like that. Osana, I try to avoid talking about this, but I'm actually very strong. If you tell me who is doing this to you, I'll stop them. What? No, I don't want you to get involved. Look. I appreciate your concern, but please, just let me deal with this myself. If you say so, but now I'm really worried. Now that you mention it, yeah, there is something I need help with. I lost my phone charm. It's in the shape of a cat. I know that I lost it somewhere in the hedge maze, but I don't want to go back in there. It's scary. I'm worried I'll get lost and be stuck in there for hours. I 
feel bad for asking, but would you be willing to go into the hedge maze and get my phone charm for me? Really? You'll do it? You're a lot more brave than I am. Good luck! What's this? Maybe I should meet them. You wanted to meet me? Your note said that you wanted to talk about... Blackmail? Yes. I heard you talking with your friend. I know that you have a stalker. And I know that he's blackmailing you. No, you've got the wrong idea. I mean, yeah, someone is stalking me, but he's not blackmailing me. Then, why don't you call the police? He's... he's got a... he's got a hostage. He's threatening to harm them if I go to the cops. What? Who is being held hostage? I know you're not going to be able to take me seriously after you hear this. It's my cat. My pet cat. He kidnapped her, and he said he's gonna kill her if I call the police. He says that if I want my cat back, I have to go to his house. But I know that if I step foot inside of his home, he won't let me leave. Has he given you his address? Well, yes, but... Tell me where he lives. Why? What are you planning to do? I'm going to rescue your cat. What? Don't try it! He's a dangerous person! So am I. You don't know what you're getting yourself into! Just hand over his address and let me handle it. Fine. I just want this horrible experience to end, one way or another. I'll text you his address. Thank you. But don't blame me if you get hurt. And don't let anything happen to my cat! Don't worry. Leave it to me.
your brother's bed? You have... Now, where did I put that cake mix? Hmm, I think I'll add some extra frosting. My love, my queen, my goddess. I knew you were real. I knew you existed somewhere in the real world. I knew we'd finally be together one day. That girl is the conduit. The way you will enter this world. If she dyes her hair and wears the right clothing, I'll be able to hold you at last. It's really going to happen. You will be mine. You will belong to me. I will possess... Huh? Who are you? How did you get in here? To return your cat and I need to have an important discussion with you but it's too late at night right now please meet me at my house before school tomorrow I will and one last time thank you You have a nice place, Yanchan. Thanks. Where are your parents? Overseas. So you take care of yourself? That must be hard. I manage. I want to thank you again for rescuing my cat and saving me from that stalker. That was a horrible experience. I'm so glad it's all over. The tea is ready. I'll be right back. Feel free to keep talking. I can't imagine what it's like to become obsessed with someone after meeting them for the first time. It doesn't make any sense. I'm shocked that there are people in this world who would actually be willing to harm a cat just to get what they want. That's insane! He said he loved me, but I don't think it was love. It was just a sick, twisted obsession that he believed was love. It makes me feel sick. But starting today, I won't have to worry about it anymore. It's all thanks to you. Here's your tea. Thank you. Oh, I just realized I've been rambling this entire time. You said you had something important to tell me, right? Yes. It's about the boy from Class 3, too. The boy you have a crush on. Huh? huh? I don't have a crush on him. He's just my childhood friend, that's all. I don't have feelings for him at all. If that's true, then you wouldn't mind if I confessed my love to him, would you? Huh? Confess your... love? Are you saying that you have feelings for him? Yes. Deep feelings. I've never felt this way about anyone before. And I can't bear the thought of seeing him with anyone else. I know that you love him, and I know that this is a selfish request, but please, don't take him away from me. Let me try to win his heart. You got me. It's true. I do have feelings for him. But after everything you've done for me... I could never take someone away from you. Okay. I'll do as you've asked. I'll stay away from him. Thank you. But 
You'd better take really good care of him, okay? Don't worry. I will. You have a nice place, Yanchan. Thanks. Where are your parents? Overseas. So you take care of yourself? That must be hard. I manage. I want to thank you again for rescuing my cat and saving me from that stalker. That was a horrible experience. I'm so glad it's all over. The tea is ready. I'll be right back. Feel free to keep talking. I can't imagine what it's like to become obsessed with someone after meeting them for the first time. It doesn't make any sense. I'm shocked that there are people in this world who would actually be willing to harm a cat just to get what they want. That's insane! He said he loved me, but I don't think it was love. It was just a sick, twisted obsession that he believed was love. It makes me feel sick. But starting today, I won't have to worry about it anymore. It's all thanks to you. Here's your tea. Thank you. Oh, I just realized I've been rambling this entire time. You said you had something important to tell me, right? Yes. It's about the boy from Class 3, too. The boy you have a crush on. Huh? I... I don't... I don't have a crush... on... Something's... wrong. I feel so... <sighs> Sleepy. Why are you smiling? Huh? What is this? Why am I tied to a chair? Why are you doing this? This isn't funny! Let me go! Let me go right now!